Nosebleeds are common in both children and adults. They are usually easily treated and don't return. Nosebleeds can be distressing for children and embarrassing to adults. Blood vessels in the nose are very close to the skin and easily damaged by putting things into the nose, stress and illness. Nosebleeds can be caused by a physical impact to the nose or being hit in the face. Be careful in stopping the nosebleed. If you think the nose may be broken or there are external injuries, you need to take extreme care. Treatment for someone with a nosebleed is first get them to sit down. If needed, calm them down and reassure them. Lean them forward and maintain their airway and prevent the blood from going down their throat, which could cause nausea or vomiting. Get them to pinch the soft part of their nose. This will allow the blood flow to stop. You may want to give them a bowl so they can spit out any blood rather than swallowing it, and if needed, give them some tissues as well. Leave the pressure on the nose for at least 10 minutes and then gently remove the fingers to see if bleeding has stopped. If it's not stopped, then you can repeat with another 10 minutes of pressure. If the bleeding has not stopped within 30 minutes, you need to take them to a medical professional. Tell them to avoid sniffing, coughing, blowing their nose or talking, as all of these can start the bleeding over again and prevent healing. Regular nosebleeds may be an indication of something more serious and a visit to the doctor is advised. Children who suffer from regular nosebleeds often grow out of them without any medical treatment.